Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. Llama 3 large language model by Meta has been out for a few days now and now you can run that it's tiny enough for you to run in your own computer without any internet connection. But it's difficult to install those open source models with you have to open command prompt and all of these things. But this tool lets you run any open source tool without the knowledge of coding. You just have to click few buttons and it installs downloads everything for you and installs it in your computer so that you can run it locally here it's called pinocchio and you can uh, you have a lot of lists of all the open source tools there's uh, de dev tool uh, and some image generation tools face swapping tools even audio editing tools like here once you download it you'll you won't have anything here uh, it will be blank then you have to go into the discover tab and if you click open anything for example i'll click on this one you have to click on download it downloads the file for you you just have to wait for, for some time and after that some something like this the llama tool i have downloaded here if i open that and then after i have to click on install if it's not installed for me and if it's already installed if i click on here it's already there it's reinstalling for me click on invoke ai which is like a open source image editor i will click on start and it starts the terminal where it loads all the files that has it, it has installed from the internet in your local drive like this you can even go to comfy ui for example i i want to open this one see the comfy ui is already running here you have everything interactable if you want you can open this up in your external browser which is your chrome browser and you'll get a better view so as you can see at the top left, I'm running it locally. And if I play this based on your machine power, it will be able to generate. This tool is really helpful. You can really go in and use the all the open source model that is there. And you don't have to worry about getting opening GitHub and everything. It will just do it for you. And you just have to click on it and uh, click on web UI or there will be a start button. You have to click on start button. So it's very really easy. You just have everything is on the left hand side. So you'll be able to once it's ready, you'll be able to click on that and run it.